Good afternoon, my name is Peter Aleskis and I'm the National Sales Manager here at Test Products International in Beaverton, Oregon. I'm here this afternoon to demonstrate some of the capabilities and the unique features of our Model 621 differential pressure meter. Um, the Model 621 is unique in the fact that it does do differential pressures and in the range of negative 40 to positive 40 inches of water column it reads resolution of 0 0.001 inches of water column. So that is very important when you're dealing with oil fired equipment. Um, you need to be really low in terms of the resolution and this particular instrument has that accuracy for you. Um, the total range on the instrument is plus or minus 120 inches of water column. Uh, these particular instruments are temperature compensated. What that means is they have circuitry inside that allows you to take the uh, instrument off of your truck or out of a cold environment, go inside of a nice warm environment, and temperature compensation will mean that you will still get an accurate reading with your device. Uh, there's some competitors on the marketplace. Their instruments are not temperature compensated. And if you were to take it from a cold area to a warm area and take your pressure readings, they can be up to 20 to 25 percent um, off in that instance. This instrument, as I said, was dual um, dual input, so it'll pressure it'll measure pres uh, pressure in terms of both negative and positive pressure. It has a mode that we call trim mode, and that is uh, useful when you're dealing in applications that have erratic um, measurements and pressure. They're going up and down, and this this equal sign that indicates the trim mode. You can hit the trim mode, and that will stabilize your readings. There are seven different units of measure for this particular advice, device. Um, the most common, of course, is inches of water column, but it will also do uh, PSI, uh, millimeters of mercury, uh, millibars, kilopascals, and, and some others that I'll get to later. Um, this particular instrument is useful when you're adjusting um, appliance regulators, you're setting um, delivery pressures, you're doing regulator adjustments, uh, you're testing pressure switches, you know, that can be in a two-stage uh, gas furnace. You can test both the positive and the negative pressure. So it's very helpful, very useful instrument um, in the technician's toolbox. This instrument also has a three-year warranty on it. It has a suggested retail price of $199.95. It is powered by standard alkaline batteries. Um, and I think if you go out there and shop around a little bit and you compare our accuracy and our price to some of the others on the market, you'll notice that this is a uh, very competitively priced and accurate, accurate unit. Um, it's very simple to use. It comes with silicon tubing. It comes with your um, quarter-inch NPT fittings. These you can actually screw right in to take your gas pressure readings. And one of the more um, useful optional accessories are these pitot tubes. Um, if you're trying to take static pressures, you can actually drill a hole inside your furnace flue. Um, put these. There's magnets on side here. You can actually put these up against the furnace and have your pitot tube facing in the direction of the air, airflow, and you can take your static pressure uh, reading. So that's, that's another nice little, um, nice little accessory. So just in order to, to, to use this instrument, very simple, as I said, you just turn the unit on, it takes a couple seconds here to warm up, and it's showing in inches of water column 0, 0.000. Now if we didn't have a zero point, as we, when we turn on the instrument, we can just tap the zero button or the power button and that will zero it out for us. Um, the different units of measure, like I said, if you press the unit button, I can read here in millimeters of H2O, millibars, kilopascals, here's PSI, inches of mercury, millimeters of mercury, and then back to inches of water column. Very simple, if I apply pressure to the positive pressure port, the instrument begins instantaneously reading the positive pressure. Take my finger away and apply it to the negative once again, I've got negative pressures reading instantaneously. Um, this little light button here turns on, the, turns on the backlight. If I just hit that, then the backlight will come on. It will automatically go off as well. But that's very useful if you're using this instrument where um, there's difficult lighting conditions. And um, that feature is built into the unit as well. So um, if you need additional information on any of our pressure manometers, we make um, quite, a, quite a wide range of these, a series of these products. Um, feel free to visit our website. Our website is www.testproductsintl.com. And if you're just interested in purchasing, um, finding out where you can purchase one of these instruments, um, finding out a distributor in your area, a wholesaler in your area, please feel free to give me a call. Once again, my name is Peter Aleskis, and my telephone number here is 1-800-368-5719. Thank you so much.